my beloved brothers and sisters, Christianity is comforting, but it is often not comfortable. The path to holiness and happiness here and hereafter is a long and sometimes rocky one. It takes time and tenacity to walk it. But of course, the reward for doing so is monumental. This truth is taught clearly and persuasively in the 32nd chapter of Alma in the Book of Mormon. There this great high priest teaches that if the Word of God is planted in our hearts as a mere seed, and if we care enough to water, weed, nourish, and encourage it, it will in the future bear fruit which is most precious, sweet above all that is sweet, the consuming of which leads to a condition of no more thirst and no more hunger. Many lessons are taught in this remarkable chapter, but central to them all is the axiom that the seed has to be nourished and we must wait for it to mature. We look forward with an eye of faith to the fruit thereof, the record says. Our harvest, Alma quotes, comes by and by. Little wonder that he concludes his remarkable instruction by repeating three times a call for diligence and patience in nurturing the Word of God in our hearts waiting, as he says, with long suffering for the tree to bring forth fruit unto you. I bear witness of God's love and of the restoration of his glorious gospel, which is in one way or another, the answer to every issue we face in life in the redeeming name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.